Hello guys Welcome back to my channel Kerja Data Online In this video, we are going to discuss the setup for using MAX30100 Pulse Oximeter Okay, this is the setup of our um, project So we have the LCD with the I2C module over here And then we have the I2C connected uh, with our MAX30100 sensor And together with the Bluetooth module so the reason of attaching the Bluetooth module is basically we want to communicate our result into our smartphone so that we can make a record uh, from our serial Bluetooth monitor. So I'm going to use the Arduino Uno and then attach together with the Arduino Sensor Shield version 5 over here. So without further delay, let us go into the setup of this um, module. So the first one we have here is the LCD uh, attached with the I2C are going to be attached at the I2C module over here on the sensor shield version 5 and then at the A4 and A5 of this analog pin we got the A4 and A5 are already being attached with our MAX30100 and then I'm going to use the Bluetooth soft serial communication for the HC05 where the initial connections are as follows so we have the VCC go to the 5 volt, ground go to the ground and then the TX are and also RX are going to be connected at the uh, digital pin number 3 and number 2 respectively okay, ladies and gentlemen so based on our project that we already explained before we have this MAX30100 pulse oximeter sensor if you can see over here when I put my finger then the heart rate and also the SPO2 level are going to be indicated accordingly and then after this we are going to connect it uh, with our Bluetooth so let us dive in into the code of this project so this is the code of this project so the first one we are going to initialize um, by including uh, several libraries so of course all the libraries are going to be made available on the descriptions of this video so please uh, have a look on that and then we have to define and the reporting period uh, together with the uh, initializations of our software serial together with the liquid I2C and after that we are going to call the POX as our pulse oximeter setup and then we are going to make the uh, bit detected uh, together with the serial print and then we are going to make the setup so this is our void setup where we initialize using the i2c by wire.begin and then we are going to initialize our lcd and then we are going to make some sort of uh, movement uh, in the beginning part of our lcd and then we are going to initialize our bluetooth uh, serial begin to be communicated with our uh, serial bluetooth terminal in our mobile phone and after that we are going to check our sensor and then we are going to make setup of our sensor detection module and inside the void loop if you can see over here is just going to display the heart rate and also the uh, BMP uh, slash SPO2 levels on our serial pin together with the display of the LCD uh, with regard to the heart rate and also the SPO2 level and then we are going to send to the Bluetooth serial where we are going to communicate with our HC05 and then send the data to our serial Bluetooth terminal inside our mobile phone so that is uh, all and all about our uh, code so let's just um, go to the tools and then uh, choose your appropriate um, development board and then you are going to upload the code okay just upload the code we are going to upload the code as usual please choose accordingly your COM port and also your Arduino so after the uploading is being done then you can watch the LCD are going to be displayed and then showing the heart rate and also the pulse okay so the initialization begin and then if you can see over there on our LCD monitor the data is already been showing the heart rate and also the SPO2 level uh, based on the finger that we put on the sensor so this data also can be transmitted through the HC05 over here, the Bluetooth module, to be sent into our smartphone. So let me just open our smartphone to give you an idea how we are going to connect this thing. So first of all, you can go to this, what we call it as the um, Arduino uh, Serial Bluetooth. Okay, so we are going to make a connection. Alright, so just... Uh, allow the turning on of the Bluetooth and then there will be some initialization with regard to the connection of the HC05 okay if you can see 
the heart rate and also the SpO2 are going to be recorded on our smartphone. So we can choose this three dot over here and then you can just go to the data and then make the login. So after that, the, the uh, monitor are going to start logging for this data. So the data is already being displayed uh, on the LCD and also can be displayed on your smartphone. So um, this is one of the very uh, benefited method, especially if you want to continuously monitor uh, your patient or your respondent with regard to their um, heart rate and also the SpO2 level that should be monitored especially during this exposure to the um, virus uh, COVID-19. So um, that's all for today. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoy and please do comment on the down there what do you think about this project and if you already uh, encounter any problem just uh, put some comment down there and I'm happy, I'm, I'm happy to discuss uh, further in the future. Thank you very much for watching and see you again next time. Bye-bye.